Hello, I'm Philip Stoughton. I'm here on the Scoop Studio at SMT Nuremberg and I'm joined by Volker Papp from Viscom. Volker, thanks for stopping by. Always a pleasure to chat to you. What's, uh, what's happening in the German market on the, on the inspection side for you guys at the moment? Well, actually, we're quite happy with what's going on. So you can imagine our figures are going up. Uh, last year, they have been going up even more than we thought initially, as almost for everybody. Yeah. But especially in, in Europe, the business is very good. Amer America is a bit weak at the time being, maybe for political reasons, decisions are, for investments are difficult. But we're quite happy that the Asian market for us is also growing quite rapidly. So uh, business is doing good in China and all over Asia. That's very good. And what, what are people looking for at the moment? What are they What are they demanding from their inspection equipment that's new? Well, actually, we're we're um, developing every year new things into our machines or completely new machines, and everybody wants to utilize the forefront of technology. That's as usual. Yeah? But especially in Asia, we notice that there's a, an increase of demand of automatization in general, but especially of high-end uh, quality assurance equipment, which is also ours, um, more than in the past. Uh, they want to have real quality, want to manufacture real quality more than in the past, just mass uh, uh, now better, and that's that's good for us. Yeah, and, and as you say, more automation. How, how do you meet that automation challenge? Um, with products that are often seen as having quite a lot of manual manual um, interaction? Well, actually, in general, we still find productions where there's no AOI or no AXI. Yeah? So this is general attend, uh, a trend to, to go that way, even on the low level. Yeah? On the other hand, uh, we invest a lot into high-level software up to artificial intelligence tools which are integrated into our uh, products to improve the easiness of, of operation so that even not so high level educated people can handle that more easy. And on the other hand, it's, it's rapid programming and so on and so forth. All the things you're looking for since years, but the artificial intelligence technology gives us some, some tools which are new to this application. Yeah. And when you look forward at artificial intelligence, is that someone you need partners for? How do you develop an artificial intelligence platform? Well, both ways. We, we, we try to integrate tool packages which are available and give you the route, but we have the specialists on board. We hired several people on, in, in Hanover mainly to integrate all the knowledge which you, which you need to uh, apply these tools to your special needs and uh, they, they bring that with them from the university or from wherever they are, and that's the way we're going. In this or that case, we hire external companies for a short period, but that's no, not our basic trend. Yeah. We try to integrate the important pieces into our company. Yeah, you want them internally, don't you? And I think for me, the, the important thing there is you've got to have the AI skills, digital twin skills, all that, but you've also got to have the deep domain expertise yeah. in optical inspection, which is what you've always had. And, you need to be able to combine both. Of exactly, that's that's it. And even our old fellows, which are coming from the old school software development, are highly interested in doing this step and learning new features. And they work hard to to catch up with the new guys on board. And that's interesting to see uh, in parallel to what what's coming out of it. Yeah. I think in the next 12 months or 18 months, going forward to the next product, Tronica, we're going to be talking more and more about AI and we're going to see more and more solutions. Step by step, it, it will be introduced into our product range and first things you can see already, the next things will come out the next month. Fantastic, Volker, thanks for stopping by. Always a Thank pleasure you. to see you. Thank you. Thank you.